Hey Calloway, this story is called Don't Feed the Pigeons and it's written by Anne Hearth. Eva and Tony ate lunch in the park. A pigeon landed next to their bench. Eva gave him a piece of her sandwich. If you look at the picture, you can see Eva and the sandwich and the pigeon and her friend Tony. Don't feed the pigeon, Tony said. Why not? Eva asked as she took a bite of her sandwich. If you feed one, hundreds will come. You can see in the picture, there's already two pigeons and she is only holding her sandwich. Another pigeon landed on the bench. Eva gave him a piece of her sandwich. Tony shook his head. You'll be sorry. He stood up. I'm going to the corner store. Do you want to come? Eva looked at the pigeons. I'll wait here. I'll be right back. Don't feed the pigeons. A third pigeon landed on the bench. Eva gave him a piece of her sandwich. <laughs> Suddenly, pigeons came from everywhere. They flapped and fluttered. They covered the ground. They covered the bench. Look at all of the pigeons. Can you count how many pigeons there are? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen pigeons in the picture. My goodness, that's a lot of pigeons. She's only got two bites into her sandwich. The sky was full of pigeons. There were hundreds of them. Eva threw pieces of her sandwich to them. Soon her sandwich was all gone. People walked past. They smiled and shook their heads. You shouldn't feed the pigeons, a little boy yelled. Eva waved her arms. One by one, the pigeons flew away. When Tony came back, the pigeons were gone. He took a bite of his sandwich. Eva's stomach grumbled. She was still hungry. She watched Tony as he ate his lunch. What's wrong? Tony asked. I'm still hungry. Eva rubbed her stomach. You fed the pigeons, didn't you? Eva nodded. Did you give them all of your lunch? Asked Tony. Eva nodded. Her stomach grumbled again. Here, said Tony. He held out half of his sandwich. You can have my sandwich. You have to promise me one. I know that I promise never to feed the pigeons. <laughs> there are a few questions for this as well. So the first question is, what does Eva feed the pigeons? The second question is, what happens to Eva's lunch? The third question, where does Tony go in the story? And the fourth question, what does Eva promise never to do again? Hint, it's at the top of the page. <laughs> I hope you enjoyed that story and I hope you're having a good summer.